show written by Sarah Mann Brandy today is um, called A Death in the Family, and it is, um, the characters will be Lydia, played by Sarah Vaninker, uh, Eleanor, played by Emily Coffin, um, Lottie, played by Devin Kiernan, and Waiter, played by Alex Nicosia. Or Nicosia. Yes, thank you. Lydia, late 20s, established businesswoman, the older of two sisters, very motherly and polite, stern and stoic, as opposed to her younger sister, who is the complete opposite. Eleanor, early 20s, college student, a younger of the two sisters, very upbeat and relaxed, um, wears her heart on her sleeve and is a bit bitter towards her older sister, Lydia, because of their childhood. Charlotte, um, the sister's cousin, the girls were raised by their mother, Aunt Ruth, Lottie's mother. Waiter, a waiter at the restaurant, the sisters are at. Enough said. <laughs> at Rise, the scene begins <laughs> with Lydia sitting at the restaurant, adjusting the salt and pepper shakers, sipping out of water, looking down at her phone every now and again. She appears agitated, constantly looking around past the table next to her and the chairs next to that. Eleanor hurries in, smiling, letting out a puff of air, and taking off her jacket, draping it over the chair. Wow, great of you to make it, sis. <laughs> Wouldn't want to miss it. Really? You're really gonna disregard the fact you're an hour late? Hey, I was busy with class. Eleanor smirks over at her sister as the other glares back. Eleanor sits down in her chair and looks over a menu. El, it's Saturday. You don't have classes today. Oh wow, you actually want to pay attention to where I was for once. Great job, sister of the year. Lydia huffs, glaring at her even, even more at her sister and her sarcasm. Eleanor, please, can't we just be adults for once, please? I asked you here because this is important. Eleanor's demeanor softens, her smirk crumbling away as a sense of dread fills the air. What is it? It's Aunt Ruth. Lydia's voice cracks softly as she speaks. The younger of the two swallows her prior cockiness, completely gone as she hears the news. Quickly, she tries to change the subject, becoming, becoming naturally unhappy. So what are you gonna order? I'm starving. Really? What? What am I doing now? Am I not sitting up straight? What? Can't you just listen to me, Elle, please? This is serious. Eleanor laughs, a short, pitiful bark. I understand it's serious, Lydia. I understand, but I don't care. This woman raised us. Mom raised us. Mom wasn't home at all when we were kids. Elle, please just let me tell you what happened. Lydia grabs Eleanor's hands in her own, begging for some sort of cooperation. Her desperation is evident. Fine. What happened to Aunt Ruth? Aunt Ruth won the Powerball. <laughs> Eleanor visibly relaxes, laughing softly for a moment, and then looking at her sister in confusion. I thought she died! Why would you build it up like that, Lydia? Well, I wasn't finished, you idiot. Then finish! What happened? Lydia hesitates. We are not in the inheritance. What? Why? <laughs> Who else would she give all that money to? Lottie! Charlotte! Satan incarnate! <laughs> Eleanor rolls her eyes, slumping back in her chair. Are you sure we didn't get anything? Maybe she forgot to say anything to you about adding us? Charlotte called me after Aunt Ruth called her. She said she was set for life. Oh, I can't believe that old hag would exclude us like that. Lydia sighs. Placing her head in her hands, the waiter stops by the table. Can I get you two anything to drink? Can you get me coffee? Black? I'll have the same. The waiter exits, leaving the girls looking distraught. We can't just let her get all of Aunt Ruth's money. Well, we can't just convince the woman. After all, she was the one who watched us when Mom wasn't around. You admit she raised us. Shut up. <laughs> Lydia rolls her eyes. Charlotte is Aunt Ruth's only child. I mean, it, it makes sense that she'd get the money. Are you just gonna give up that easily? We deserve that money even more than Lottie does. Well, how do you suggest we get it then, genius? Well, we can't convince Ruth. We know that. We also know that she's old as dirt. So we can hope that she comes to her senses and adds us in before she kicks it. Eleanor Marie! What? You can't just say that. Well, how are we going to get the money from Lottie? Well, I don't know. From what we've experienced growing up with her, we know she won't ever give up the money willingly. Both sit in silence for a moment, before Eleanor slams her hand on the table. What? I have an idea. <laughs> hmm. We can't convince her to give it up, you know? It's risky. What? Should we kill her or something? Eleanor, <laughs> <laughs> Eleanor nods slowly, smirking. Lydia just stares in shock. We can't. 
It's either her or over tens of millions of dollars. Lydia sits in silence for a moment and then looks up at her sister. So we killed her. <laughs> we kill Lottie and that money is ours. <laughs> well, I guess we have a murder plan then. The waiter comes back with their coffees and exits quickly. The sisters look at one another and nod, reaching out to shake each other's hands and nod. The lights fade out and the actors exit. When the lights come back on, the two sisters walk in squabbling. The pair sits down, glaring at one another. What can I get you two today? For Coffee, black. The waiter is clearly taken aback. He nods and slowly backs away from the clearly fighting sisters. I cannot believe the stunt you just pulled back. How was I supposed to know she wouldn't be home? You never listen to me. You are just like mom. Why? Just because I don't listen to you constantly? Jesus Christ, Liddy. You're such a control freak. Ever since we were kids, you've been so neurotic. Well, at least I learned to pay attention and try instead of just skating by without trying. It's a miracle you got into a decent college. Oh my God, you sound just like mom and Aunt Ruth. Yeah. With her head in her hands. We just need... Lottie gone. Everything will be okay after that. No more fighting, all right? Eleanor nods. The two sit in silence as the waiter brings them their coffee. They start to talk about their next attempt as he slinks away. The lights fade and the two leave. And they, uh, as they start to light again, the sisters come back in, covered in ash. Lydia looks enraged and the pair sits down. I know it looks bad, but at least we didn't die. How? <laughs> How hard is it, Liddy, to blow up? Don't you uh, dare! Ha. <laughs> the waiter comes to the table and puts down two coffees. The girls just glaring at one another. The lights, the lights fade in and out, and the girls come in. Eleanor comes in behind Lydia, her right shoulder bandaged, slightly bloodied. The older sister look at the older sister looks at the younger sister. I can't her. believe you shot me in the shoulder. <laughs> told you I have bad aim. You oh. shot me in the shoulder when she was right in front of us. Do you know how stupid you I are? I told you, you were the one ha that should have shot her. I swear this next try is the last one, and if it doesn't work, I quit. Fine. The lights fade in and out, and the duo walks into the restaurant and sit down at their usual table, both calmly sitting down. I thought you said you remembered the cyanide pills. I thought I did too. <laughs> Well, where did you leave them? My dorm room. Lydia sighs in defeat, looking at her sister. One more try? I don't know, Liddy. But she doesn't deserve the money, Eleanor. We both know this. I understand that, but she's getting suspicious. We can't risk it anymore. <laughs> She'll find out. Eleanor, please. She made our childhood hell. Her mother knows she did, she did that. The only reason Lottie got the money is because she's Aunt Ruth's biological daughter. The waiter walks in. Smiling down at the two. So, coffee? Yes, yeah, same as always. <laughs> Please. The lights fade in and out, and the sisters walk in, arms covered in blood, both looking shocked, yet smiling eerily. There is no way we messed that up. <laughs> <laughs> Since we dumped her in the lake, do you think they'll find fingerprints if her body washes ashore? Well, you're the one who's majoring in criminal justice. Aren't you supposed to know how to hide a body? <laughs> I think it's funny that you think I pay attention in my classes. <laughs> what? Look behind you. Right now. Eleanor turns. Lottie steps in towards her sisters, currently staring at her dumbstruck. Hey, you two. Fancy meeting you here. Oh, my God. So, uh, Charlotte... Where have you been all day? Oh, you know at my mother's house. The two sisters look at each other, wide-eyed and shocked. Then they gaze down at their bloodied hands. The fuck? 